Greetings and salutations, my name is GW608, and today I am playing Star Maidon. Alright, and we are here on the factory floor. Wow, that's a lot of indicators on the screen. I think it's, yeah, it's all these fighters I have. Anyway, I put iron. We are going to uh, assemble the fleet. Uh, I know the oppressor is not hostile to squadron, but still, it scares me. Anything that could destroy Armada fleet that quickly is scary. So I have put together a defense fleet, just in case uh, the thing decides to move. Currently it's with a, a uh, faction called the Lost, and I don't know what that means, but it sounds ominous. See, when we... Over here it says claim by the lost. We're neutrals, so that's good. Harrison Davis. Harrison and Davis I already have Strike Force Nemesis is out there. Uh, looks like a group of guppies, two W class frigates and an ironclad. That's out by the gate, so that's alright. Anyway, uh what are we doing today? Oh, we're assembling the fleet. Let me show you the fleet I have ready. This is 608 Prime. It comprises of the Odin as its main ship, the dirigible Charlemagne, uh, which is one of my dirigibles. It's basically a board boardroom for meetings and whatnot. Uh, two Nemesis class battleships, Mark II, the Juliet and the Romeo. Uh, four. Um, W-class frigates, the Cyclops, the Cerberus, the Minotaur, and the Griffin, and two Ironclads, Mark III, the Randolph, and the uh, Beauregard. All right, Beauregard. The other one. And I would like to put them at a position that's uh, closer to Curso Gate. Where is Curso Gate? The... Yeah, there should be here-ish. Come on, where are we? Yeah, there we go. I get turned around so bad in this map. Uh, there's a one of my fleet rendezvous points. So if we want to go here, what is that? Uh, oh, I even have pen and paper here. Uh, we want we are selected system is void. Uh, squadron is the owner of it. The sector is what we want. It's negative seventy five twenty two. 35. All right, so we're going to go ahead and jump to uh, let's see Set waypoint we want to go to Outpost beta. So why are we going to outpost beta because I want to jump I want to hit the uh, jump gate because even though I know the bugs fixed I still don't want to move these guys in loaded sectors. All right, let's see that's some more ironclads. Now there's the Romeo. That's part of the of the early and the Beauregard, Beauregard here, Beauregard I guess, and the Romeo. They're part of the new uh, 608 Prime fleet that we're going to be using as defense against against the Lost. I just have a feeling in my heart that uh, oh, there's the Wraith. No, that's not. That's it's Outpost B. Never mind. I lost my original Wraith. I don't know what I did with it. It's probably docked to the Pax Romana. And the Pax Romana will stay at the forge to provide defense there. Anyway, I just had this feeling, after what that thing did to um, Armada, that it would have no hesitation of doing the same to Squadron. All right, so we're going to go here to the the forge. I don't believe there's anybody here. Oh, there's the wraith. All right, I found it. Let's see, those were some orbs. Research pod. Yep, prime. Okay. Anyway, we're going to start moving everything to a rendezvous point. So we're going to K, give the order to move. We're going to move fleet. We're going to move fleet for great justice to 70, negative 75, 22. 35. Okay. Now. 
I should have everybody moving. Uh, let's see, and now we are going to jump there ourselves. Not range. Oh, must be two jumps from here. And we're going to save it as a waypoint. Because I think you can only save waypoints. Yeah, save current coordinates. Yeah. You can only save waypoints that you're in currently. Or save current coordinates as waypoints. So we're going to go and we're going to save this as. As, um, set waypoint, this is going to be 608, prime, on rendezvous, rendezvous, there's too many U's in rendezvous, oh, the Charlemagne's already here. The Griffin and the Juliet have arrived. Delete too many letters. That's close enough. Wrong format. Oh, no, 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 I want to save current coordinates as so wait, prime, Ron. Alright. Uh, the Minotaur, the Randolph, they're all here. Already. Oh, because they were at the, the uh, nearby rendezvous point. Okay. So while they're here, what are we going to do? I don't know. Um, let's see. I also, just in case this thing retaliates, I want the Ice Queen to be safe. So we're going to jump back to the forge. Set low point. Forge. But before we do, let's take a gander here at the Minotaur. And make sure... My, Minotaur? Minotaur? I've heard both pronunciations. I'm not sure which one's right. Anyway, I'm going to make sure it didn't lose any turrets. And see if this is one of the ones that I have public permission blocks on. Ooh, oh, there's a Charlemagne. It's closer. Oh, well, the Charlemagne doesn't have any turrets on it, because it's a dirigible. I built the dirigibles in the midst of the bug crisis, so they have absolutely no... Um, that's moving. They have no rail entities on them at all. Alright, in that case we're going to get the slower Mark III Ironclad to check. Uh, it's still got its water wheel, that's a good sign. Because it came from an unloaded to a loaded sector. I know Gary was having problems with it. Yeah, it looks like it has all his turrets. Right. And the lifeboat. And the doors for the main cargo hangar. Very good. Alright. So let's head back. Because like I said, I want to take the Ice Queen somewhere safe. So I'm going to take her to Squadron Home and dock her in my... Uh, main port, uh, and my uh, my dock there, because Squadron Home is faction homed, so it should be it should be uh, safe to, to dock and invincible, just in case the oppressor goes crazy. That is the one ship that I I kind of fond of. Right. Let's see, there's the gate to forge, outpost beta. I'm also kind of fond of the... Wait a minute, where did the Pax Romana go? I thought I told it to... Uh, Prime, Pax Romana, Order. Um, in the Sector, in the Forge. Romana is idle. Right. Order, move fleet, move to the Forge. Oh, I'm having... Ah, okay, there we go. Connection problem is saving. There we go, now she's moving to the forge. And I have a couple Nemesis class guarding the factory, 
and that all those uh, fighters you saw, so they should be safe. Outpost Alpha has a handful of ships, I believe. Outpost Beta has the handful of ironclads. I may have been building up uh, a handful of orc ships. Um, 70 something last time I counted. Anyway, let's see. Let's see, I want to load um, HQ. And let's jump right there. But I want things in place for time to mobilize. This is, it's been too quiet for too long. The Odin is gone, which is good, because that means she's on the way she. Or do you still name, refer to a ship as a she if it is a male name? It. It is on its way to the prime rendezvous. I'm, I might assemble some of these fighters as a secondary group. I don't think those little fighters, other than being cannon fodder, are going to be much good against the oppressor. That, and I imagine, when and or if it attacks, we will have a joint assault force from Squadron. And I'll let the other guys do the smaller stuff. I'll bring the big heavy hitters to, uh, to, uh, hit heavy. And, uh, soak up some damage. Alright. So let's see. I want... Ah, the Ice Queen. Is it destination and activate? Uh, it's been too long since I boarded the Ice Queen. This war just kept me in warships more than useful utility vehicles. That saddens me, because I really like this ship. Until the updates come out and breaks everything on it, and I decide to rebuild it from scratch. Alright, so let's do the rail docker. I believe it is three jumps from here to Squadron Home. Load waypoint. Squad Home. Ah, oh, it's only going to be two jumps from here. That's not bad. Better than... So it may have been easier to do two jumps than jump over to the rendezvous than go all the gate nonsense that I just did. Anyway, they've said that good generals talk about tactics. Great generals talk about logistics. And I have a handful of ships that I need to move, and I need to have them positioned so they can get to the battle quickly and easily should should they be called upon. All right. Ooh, what are these? What are these? Sapson. Mass of point one. Oh, good grief. Uh, we're going to stop. We're going to save these coordinates as... Car scene and Sapson find me now. No, mind me now. Because I have been scouring the stinking galaxy for Sapson. And Percine. And I will have to come back with a stouter ship. Or with a stouter miner to. Uh... I see something fly at me. That's strange. Anyway, I thought I saw something fire. Anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and head over to back to station. Oh, it looked. Uh, I'm pointing at my cursor. the The indicator for the asteroids was jumping back and forth. I'm probably because it's at a weird angle and it's trying to determine if it should be on the left or the right. Anywho, I thought something was firing a beam. Right, and here we are back home. Get ever so humble, wherever I roam. Something, 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 there's no place like home. And I'm sure somebody in the comments will give me the correct saying of that uh, poem. Well, this must be Charlotte Moore's uh, ship. I really like this ship. It's kind of compact, and I imagine she packs a good punch. Hopefully she won't be lost in, uh, in the inevitable conflict. Alright, I am home, so let's choose a... 
vertically to dock. Let's go into this camera to dock. We're going to dock vertically so we fit and aren't in anybody's way. All right. I have been JW608. This has been Star Made. And I finally decided to play with end cards, so I'm going to roll that now. Have fun. Thanks for watching. If you'd like to subscribe, you can click the, uh, the little circle-y thing at the top left there. Or if you'd like to support me on Patreon, the link's right below that, the big P. If you don't want to do either of those things, but you want to watch some more, there's a couple links to the right. I suggest the one on the top. That's, that's one of my favorites. Anyway, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed.